and welcome to Diet.com. My name is Stacey Venegro, and today I have with me Lisa demonstrating how to use uh, the punching bag today. So instead of going to the gym and just running on the treadmill to get your heart rate up or doing the elliptical and you want to switch it up a little bit, grab some um, gloves and let's work out on the bag because you can get your heart rate up real quick and we can get um, burn a lot of calories here. So first we're going to start off with just facing the bag. You're going to face straight. Knees going to be slightly bent, separated apart. We're going to face square to the bag. And you're just going to extend punches straight to the bag. Extend, extend. Making sure you're breathing, OK? Good. Notice how her arms are extending forward. She's staying square to the bag. And she's not twisting her core side to side. She's keeping it nice and engaged. Excellent. Now we're going to switch it up. We're going to change it up to um, a different type of style. So now she's going to put whatever your, um, if you're dominant right, put your left foot in front. If you're dominant left, put your right foot in front. So she's going to shoot here with the left jab, crossover right. Left jab, crossover right. Good. Left, right. Left, right. Core is tight and making sure you're breathing. Good. Put some power behind those punches. This way you'll get a nice workout in. Excellent. Now we're going to go into the two jabs, right crossover. So it's going to go left, left, right. And begin. Left, left, right. Good. Left, left, right. Keeping sure that you're uh, keeping in mind that your body is nice and tight, your core is extremely tight, and you're extending those arms out. Okay, now we're going to go into left, right, kick. So now we're going to bring the leg up. We're going to start working the, the leg. If you want to switch over to the other side, you can. It's totally up to you. So we go left, right, kick. Left or right, left, kick. Good. Kick. Excellent. You want to get that foot up. It doesn't need to be all the way up to your head, but just make sure you get it up to hip level and get that bag. One more. Excellent. Now you're going to take a step to the bag, and we're just going to do some hooks coming right in. You want to make sure you pivot that foot at the bottom. Pivot. Get some power from those legs. Good. Around and hit that bag nice and hard. Breathing. And three, two, and break. Good. Now you can repeat that whole sequence that we just did, three rounds with 10 to, 10 to 15 second rest in between, or push yourself to four. So I really hope you enjoyed this workout. Stay tuned for more videos from diet.com.